A Central Texas man is forming a new nonprofit for drug overdose awareness. This comes after his son tragically died from a fentanyl overdose. The organization's mission is to prevent overdose deaths, bring awareness and educate families on how one pill can kill. Six News reporter Sydney Deshawn joins us live now in the studio with more on their fight. Sydney. Yeah, Chris and Lindsay, the goal is to get Narcan in every classroom and train people on recognizing an opioid overdose. I spoke with Charlie Lumpkins, who was motivated to start Flashway Fentanyl after his 32 year old son Tyler died from fentanyl overdose. He shares with students across Central Texas his son's story in hopes they understand how the one pill can kill. April 19th is when Lumpkin says he got the dreaded knock on his door from police early in the morning. I pulled the, the blind back and I said, sir, please don't tell me my son's dead. And, and he said, yes, sir, he is. And I, I, I didn't know what to do. I never had to plan a funeral. This is my child. A parent isn't supposed to, to, to bury their child. Now on your screen is the organization's number. If you need help or have questions, Lumpkins is also in the process of making this into a 501 C3 organization. He's trying to raise the funds to do so, so he can get grants from national and local places. We have more details on everything on our website at KCENTV.com. And later tonight at six, we will share more from other members about their fight to save lives. Guys. Yeah, yeah Sydney, important. thank you. Yeah, the tragedy's played mm -hmm. out over and over again across the country. Important cause.